Okay guys, so now I'm going to teach you how to mix your HCG. First thing, you need to make sure that your amber bottle is open and clean. Secondly, you want to just go ahead and rip off this green tab on your HCG if you have the same type of vial that I do. Make sure you clean the top with an alcohol wipe. If you have this type of a vial of HCG and this is not HCG here, you just want to go ahead and locate that white line, get a towel, and snap that glass off and it'll break right off. It should have a clean break. Then you want to get your silver and you want to draw up 1 ml. I want, I'm going to draw a little bit more and release the rest. And I see I have a bottle, a bubble, excuse me, in there so I'm going to release it. Once you have one ml drawn, it should look like that, bubble free, you want to go ahead and slowly mix it into your HCG. Then you want to get your ACG and just swirl it around. Do not shake. Simply swirl. And it will mix right up. Then you want to get your syringe, puncture the bottle again, and draw up all the HCG that's in here. and then put it into your amber bottle. Make sure you get every drop out of your syringe and your bottle. And I still have some down there at the bottom. Just a quick heads up. You're going to have to withdraw out of your vowel a couple of times. I had to do it maybe three or four times to get every drop and now the bottle is completely empty. Then I'm going to go back to my silver and draw one ml. Once you've gotten that 1 ml of silver, place it down and just go ahead and inject it right into your amber bottle. Lift it and push it up again just to make sure you get everything that's in your syringe. Okay, that should do it. Okay guys, so now you need to go ahead and take this needle off of this syringe and all you have to do is simply twist. It comes off that easy. Pick up your 12 ml syringe and twist it on and make sure it's on tightly. Now I'm going to open my B12 and draw 12 ml of B12. Once you've drawn up your 12 ml of B12, you're going to inject that into your amber bottle. OK, 
Okay, once you've inject all of that, you need to pull up one more 1 ml. Okay, I pulled up one more ml of B12 and I'm going to put that into the amber bottle as well, totaling 13 ml. And just lift it a couple of times just to make sure you get all of it out. Okay. Okay, so now you just want to go ahead and put your top back on your amber bottle. And at this point, you don't want to shake. You only want to swirl. So just give it a couple swirls to mix up. And then you're done mixing your HCG. Go ahead, store this in the fridge, and also store your B12 because it's now open. Store your B12 in the refrigerator, and that's it. You'll be ready to use in the morning.